for joining us. I'm Tyler Burke. The Idaho Fish and Game Department, along with federal agencies, are on a mission to restore a tree species that's been rapidly disappearing in the woods of eastern Idaho. Local News 8's Luke Jones shows us how they use fire to burn some trees and give new life to others. You're looking at one massive inferno. A thousand acres engulfed in flames just 13 miles southwest of Swan Valley. But this fire is no accident. I want to kind of maybe take a little path right yeah, through the yeah. bottom there. Rangers with the Idaho Fish and Game Department, as well as the U.S. Forest Service, are on the scene with a mission in mind. What we did was uh, put our black line in place, and we started up here on Commissary Ridge, bringing fire down off into the bottom where we're at here. They're trying to save the rapidly declining aspen tree. In order to do this, they're burning conifer trees, which have been steadily intruding on aspen territory. We come out and do a bunch of uh, slashing of conifer. Uh, before we look to uh, come out and burn, and we usually do that four months to a year ahead of time. In addition to taking out conifers, you can see some of the pre-burn slashing we have done in here. They say fire has the added benefit of stimulating aspen regrowth. Top killing aspen, as you kind of see here, will help uh, uh, revegetate aspen in this area. The work is tiresome and frequently depends on nature itself. Hopefully our weather cooperates today to be able to bring the heli torch out and start with our uh, aerial ignitions on the unit today. It looks like they're in luck. Once the flames die down, rangers show us the results. Everywhere you look, the progress is evident. And one day, rangers say these newly cleared woods could be filled with aspen. I would expect to see a carpet of aspen in this area, 5,000 stems per acre probably. In Idaho Falls, I'm Luke Jones. Let's take a look at